Right, guys, it's Minister here. Uh, going to do a wee bit of live streaming here. I haven't done some live streaming in a while, so uh, forgive me if, uh, if I'm a bit rusty on it. What I'm planning on doing is go through a little bit of the DNS pack we have here. We've decided to start up a new one on Colossal Craft, so we have. It's quite a good pack. I've been playing it now probably for about two weeks, just trying to understand what the pack's all about. Um, what's in it. We don't want to release it out for a public release just as yet. There seems to be a lot of items in it that aren't covered by Tony. That we'll need to sit down one day and have a look. Just to give you a rough idea, I'm looking roughly through... Let's have a look and see here. Uh, 263 pages of items that need to be, to be protected. Um, I basically need to go into a configuration file and every item ID, so Obsidian's 49, Twitch is 50, I have to add every single one that I don't want people to be able to access in other towns inside that configuration file then, so it's a little bit of work to do and it's just finding the time to do it. But what I want to do is go through, um, do some live streaming on what we do day in, day out, what the staff do. Um, as I say, I'm in TeamSpeak um, on the ts3.colossalcraft.co.uk uh, TeamSpeak down in the staff section. Um, I'll be here um, for other staff members to come on. Um, there's a few staff members that play here. Um, Madeline and Tig, um, Sarah Dawn, one of the builders. Max is here as well. Um, a few other people as well about... Um, we're all sort of building um, houses um, just to find out exactly what bypass is tiny so we can get things up and going. But um, staff members will pop by, we'll, um, we'll be playing, we'll be talking. Um, you'll probably see me dealing with some server issues. So if you're interested as well on how to diagnose server issues, how to start up a server, how Linux works, I'll be going through a wide variety of things. So it'll not just be me sitting all day playing. Which I'm sure quite a lot of you like, but to be completely honest, I find it a, a bit boring after a while, so do. So, um, did something just walk in after me there? I'll have to watch that back. Yes, so that's one of the things as well. So, all my Twitch recordings, uh, sorry, streams are going to be recorded. I will be putting them over to YouTube as well. So, if you'd rather watch them on YouTube, you can watch it on YouTube. Hmm, phone missing. Are the sheep eating the grass? Like, actually, like, the dirt and everything. Must be hungry. Yeah, I'll be putting it over to YouTube, so you guys can watch it on YouTube. Um, hopefully, my internet connection is okay here. At the minute, I've been trying to stream here for... It's at three minutes with zero dropped packets, zero percent, and 30 frames per second. So, hopefully, it runs okay for you. Um, let's just check on the sound settings as well. Um, weather. Perfect. Blocks 12, might bring it down to maybe 10, just so it runs a bit quicker. Maximum unlimited. Let's see, what's happening like? Oh, I just realised I've got a second. Let me close that. I've got Darwolf running in the background as well, so that will probably hinder my um, frames a wee bit. Yeah. There we go. That seems to be running a bit better now, at least. That's one thing I love about this mod pack, is the door. So let's see. Look how cool that looks. I honestly have no idea if that's 1710 Minecraft uh, vanilla or if it's something out of the mod pack. I just think that's pretty cool. So yeah, uh, it's just me here at the moment. I'm sure someone will pop by soon. They always do. Um, I've got wings, so that's how I can fly. Oh, I'm getting shot. Yeah, I've got um, dragon wings. Part of extra utilities. I think this is pretty cool. So creative mode flying. Where you go. I don't think it's awfully hard to build as well. Nether star. Yeah, maybe it is a bit hard to build. Um, we all decided to staff just because uh, we're lazy and we like to have god mode and we like to fly about. We wouldn't have god mode. We're not going to have creative unless we're testing something inside the ad the admin town here. Um, the only thing we are allowed to do is spawn something in so we can fly. We're not allowed to use the fly command, but we can spawn something in to fly. So, looks like someone's been doing some work here. I was on last night. And these stairs weren't here. And someone's removed the house as well. I think that was Multi's house. No, not Multi's. 
Um, whose house was that? Was it Madeline's house? Maybe. I think that's Madeline's house over here somewhere. One of them ones. I think that's Multi's house. Tickets house. Someone else is over here. Um, yeah, so we, we were set off here at one point, but it got too small. And we decided just to go mad. I'm going to get shot. What are these things? A hobgoblin? Oh, hang on. I'm just realised you can't probably can't see the name. Where will I move my camera to? Oh, get shot. What if I move it this down? Maybe I'll put it maybe in the middle. Because there's stuff that you want to see down the bottom right hand side. How far is that? So if I move that to maybe here, can you still see that? Yeah. That's alright. Does that look okay? Because this chat comes up here, so I don't want to... Yeah, maybe have that sitting there. If that annoys you, so you want somewhere else, let me know. Um, by the way, I will not be on the Twitch live chat, so if you're looking to speak to me, I'll be on the Colossal Craft Code UK live chat, which you can find um, this bar here that's jumping up and down it, you know? Go onto that website and you'll find, find it there then. My cat is here. Yes, cat? Yeah, my cat decides to cry like something demented, so she does sometimes, so... Yeah, sorry about that. I'm sure it will not last too long. But yeah, this is where my house was originally going to be. I thought this was quite a cool area. But, um... Yeah, sort of... Got small, everyone else moved over there, I felt lonely. I wanted to move over as well. So I literally copied and pasted my house over. Um, I may as well give you a quick tour. So I've literally been on this server now for about two weeks. I've been doing very, very, very little building on it, however. As in very, very little most of the time. I've been trying to find bugs, trying to find errors, trying to find things that need protected by tiny, trying to cause the TPS to raise a good bit. So I think the TPS is running okay in 19.8, which isn't bad. Um, yeah, so this is my house. Um, if you've played on any other servers with me, you'll probably see the style is practically the exact same. I can't build. I'm going to admit that now. I cannot build whatsoever. That's why I, why I run servers instead. But I still like to try and attempt to build something. Um, we've got the doors coming in. On the right hand side, I've got a little bit of storage going on here. Um, my furnaces and stuff, crafting tables, a few diamonds, a few ores, a lot of rubber woods. Um, this mod has. Oh, we've only got one hit left. Um, this mod has got tree, ta tree capitator, I think it's called. So you basically, your wooden, your wooden axe or your iron axe or whatever axe you want, you hit the bottom block of a tree and it causes the whole tree to fall. However, it'll take damage on your axe as if you were cutting down each one individually. It might even do a little bit more. Um, thus, so I decided to cut down a, what did you call it now? Rubber. There's something wrong with any eye here that I still haven't figured out. There's something, so type in... Oh, did I spell rubber wrong? Yeah, I spelled rubber wrong. Whoopsies, my bad. So you've got the normal rubber sapling, and then you've got the sacred rubber sapling, and then the mega rubber sapling. So there was one of these ones, um, the mega rubber sapling put down. Um, it is huge, but the sacred is even larger. It's massive. I think it takes up maybe 10 chunks of them, right? Um, but the mega rubber sapling maybe a few chunks at most. Um, I cut one of them down and it caused my axe to go right down from full health down to one hit left. So um, I got all that um, rubber there. I've got um, all that rubber wood there, rubber wood there. I thought I had more than that. Someone's probably been over here lifting stuff. That's one of the things. If you see people in my house lifting stuff, don't worry. It's uh, everyone in this, uh, this town is sort of sharing things with one another. I think it's good fun. Yeah, if you've ever played on any of those servers with me as well, you'll always know that I've got a fascination with great retrieves. Normally, uh, before I became a owner of the service here, I uh, was an admin on another server. We created a town called Greatwood, just because it had uh, one Greatwood in it. And ever since, any time that I create um, 
and want it and fight people and maybe make a big town, I would always call it Great Wood. Just because I think Great Wood trees are pretty awesome. You can get loot underneath them sometimes and all. It's pretty cool. Look at that sun. This pack is pretty cool. Adds all wee things in that makes it sort of interesting. I think it makes it quite good. Um, likes it down here as well. The uh, Your hearts are green now, just to go with the DNS pack. Um, but yeah, we've got quite a lot of mods in this server here. Um, far too many to go through. Quite literally. So it's we're running Minecraft 1.7.10. Um, on the mod pack, you can download the mod pack from the AT launcher. Um, I will show you this quickly now. Let me see. Um, green one. So, if I open up this, so oh, that's quite weird watching me stream again. Weird. Um, if we go on across to the um, AT launcher. website and uh, just to go to the downloads and depending on what you've got now windows bloody bloody blah, blah, blah download the exe once you've downloaded the exe place it and just run it so it'll load up supported by creep creeper host and you'll find along here on the pack section you'll find a few packs then so we're running DNS uh, tech pack. What you need to also do though is set up your account information. So your username, your password, blah, 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 and add that then. So you can see I've got mine sitting down here then. Um, go to your packs and create a new instance. Once you've got that, go to your instance and hit play. Make sure you edit your mods. So there is no disabled mods at all. We have enabled every single mod you can think of. Look at the size of that list. Yeah, we're gonna have fun. And uh, once you do that, then let you good to go. So let me just fix this back again to uh, correct screen. There we go. So yeah, that's how you can get on our pack. Then we have not released the IP address for it yet. However, we are expecting to do so within the next week or two. So jump on, give us a shout if you want um, access to the server. It is currently whitelisted. So let me know if I know you, if I trust you, if I know you're not going to do anything stupid. You, of course, you can come on and play, test things out with us. Obviously, there'll be no um, no griefing, there'll be no bypassing Tarny, for example, because Tarny is completely open at the minute. You can go and do whatever you want in other people's towns. Obviously, because I'm an owner, I still have access to it, but if I was just a normal player, I could come over and start taking whatever stuff I wanted to here. This is one thing I need to get into, the Ender IO stuff. It looks pretty cool. This house here is pretty cool. This is this Take's house. Take is always quite a good builder as well. Let's see. Um, see here. Oh, that's the all in one town. I think this is Take's house. I remember him saying something about wanting to build here. Or did he want to build over the, the hill? Quite sure. Quite cool though. Nice big garden at the back. Palm trees. This is quite cool. That's, I'm planning on something, doing like something I got at my back of my house as well, coming down onto a bit of a beach, with a few boats maybe, like, I think that'd be quite cool. Oh. These doors here don't look as cool, like, they're just open and closed, they don't have the cool graphics here, they don't. Um, we've got a lot of trees here, I think someone's trying to make a tree house. We've got the uh, Britannia stuff, uh, Madeline is really interested in it, as far as I know. Every time I see her, she's either doing something with botanic or some kind of flower in her hand, trying to do something. Um, ooh, what is this? Oh yeah, Sarah Dawn. Sarah Dawn's come in, she is building in creative, just because she likes building in creative. Um, so because it's the admin town, the spawn town, really there's no problems, you know building stuff in creative just to make things look nice and fancy. Look at all these trees. I bet you these were done by hand. Well, one does these grow like this. I'll have to test it out. Fantasy blocks. Quite cool looking. And then we like pond bit in the middle. That's really cool. What we'll do, we'll head over to the spawn location. And I think this place is pretty cool. You spawn in Sort of like the same idea as you've seen that uh, Sarah, Sarah, Sarah Donna built. 
but instead we've got a lot of statues of people about left, right and centre. Just some signs, still don't know what to put in there. I'll find something for in there. Um, basic info, the rules section, we've got nothing in here yet. Um, a few more cool people, but the ones I want to go down to is right here. Oh yeah, this is everyone who plays on our service. Well, not everyone, some of the staff. There's Kiara, Black Phoenix, we've got Blitz. Um, looks like they both having a duel with one another. Why well, Kiara's running away with flowers. Sarah Sawyer, Sarah and Mervyn, the builders and admins who like to build. We've then got, um, oh, the ghost changed his skin again. That's a bit, that looks like something that like Strictly Come Dancing, so it does. We've got Madeline who likes to build as well, take. And then, um, yeah, you can, are they shaking? Yeah, they are shaking. You've got me and Max, the two owners. Max looks like he's trying to cave my head in with something. What is that? Atomic Dissembler, that sounds pretty scary. Well, I run about with a wrench, yeah. Something, the odds Doctor Who, you know, the way he runs about with his, uh, with his screwdriver, but he still seems to get stuff done, you know. Hopefully that'll be the same for me. We've just got a few random people in here, a few cool looking skins. Stormtroopers, pretty cool. Yeah, so it's coming along quite well, I think, anyway. Head back. Definitely coming along quite well. Um, so yeah, in the middle here, we've got the elevator going down. Um, whoa, that would destroy your eyes. Imagine looking at that. Look at look at the, look at the color my face goes in stream. Look. Whoa. But yeah, so we've got um, just a few machines up and going here. Someone has done a lot of digging for it. Oh, these are probably TIG actually. The Sky Stones for um, Applied Energistics 2. Got a few basic machines up and going. I've got, and I've just realised, I am stupid. I put down an Ender Tank in the Nether. I have no idea where I put it now. Absolutely zero idea. So I'll end up having to make a new one once this runs out of lava. I think I flew away quite a, a while trying to find somewhere good to put it. So, yeah, my bad. I've got another portal down here now as well, so we don't have to run miles to try and use it. I think it was way over. Yeah, that way, potentially. But, yeah. Right, I think I'm in the mood of maybe going for some mining. That was quite sudden rain. I'm just checking the console there to make sure no one turned rain on me trying, trying to play a game, but it didn't. That was really, really sudden. Normally it like sort of goes in gently to it, I think. Anyways. Um, let's see, what do I have on me? So I've got my torches, my apples. I might need to make another shovel, potentially. Let's see, what will I make it out of? Um, I don't want to make it out of iron. I want to keep all the iron I've got. Um, lead. Let me see what's in here. I want to see. I do want to try and make an applied energetic system in here at some point as well. Maybe in against this wall, down in there, so you can just walk in and it's in the wall. Um, my house isn't that big because I was afraid of big, making it too big because it wouldn't turn out too well. So uh, I decided to make it quite small just to see how things would go. So diamonds? Should I make it out? Di no, I want to keep diamonds. Um, do you have any rubies or sapphires? Anyone got? Thought I did. Maybe don't. Maybe you have to go and mine some up. Yeah, I'll go and mine some up. One thing I wanted to show is this. Which I'm going to show you now. That made no sense, but anyway, I'm going to change it to this sun just so I can show easier. So normally, what would happen when you when you vote for any of the other servers like Dabble of Magic World, Yogg's Cast, you would get 100 cash or 150 cash, depending on how many voting links there is. You get two diamonds and one end end point. What we are planning on doing, just for a test, to see how things go. I think it sounds good. So let let me know what you think. So each time you vote, you get one end end point. And that's it. Um, 
what you can do with that then is in game you type in buy so i'm just making sure it looks right on the screen here if you click buy you can see several different shops here so dns tech pack we're on dns why not choose dns we've got ranks and we've got economy here you can buy money tiny plots and more so if we hit it then 100 cash for one point okay so instead of you having instead of you getting cash every single time you now choose you want cash or you want an extra tiny plot or you want vip for example so you can go to ranks and you can see either price is 299 in real cash or 75 points we're going to play about with these point systems we're going to see what works out best um the whole idea of this is so people can keep constantly voting and get items that they want not stuff that we tell them they want like diamonds and cash they can choose what you want instead of us telling you then so for example let's go to this and get um 100 cash one point so you bring up this you can either go back this is this gold bar is just a sort of description of it and then here you go buy with points one point so i'm going to click that down the bottom side please wait as we verify your purchase purchase complete you now have 57 points remaining and the hundred has been added to my account easy as what else could what else could you want for that that works perfectly so we could add it in that maybe you do want diamonds we could maybe do two diamonds for one point or five diamonds for one point we could maybe set it up oh you want to get a solar panel well that would be a hundred points there you go after you vote for what's that um one point so 100 days that's not going to be the actual thing maybe uh, maybe we'll do it for 30 so each mo each month you can um get a solar panel if you want but you'll you'll not be able to you'll need to still get some money sometimes to keep your town up and going to be able to trade and buy with other players in game i think it's going to introduce a more real feeling instead of money just being given to you you can choose what you want to do with it so i think that's a quite a cool system let me know what you guys think i will be putting a post up on the website about it and uh maybe a poll to see what you think um i'll also be recording the tutorial so people who haven't watched this so they can see themselves as well then excuse me a second i get very thirsty when i'm on talking um so yeah that's that system up and going so uh why don't we go for mining a bit now i know they did tell me there was a mine around here somewhere Is it over this way uh, there's definitely one over there that i normally go to this is the one is this one here looks like it oh i hear baddies what was that what is that oh is that oh that's the hobgoblin they're weird oh yeah oh wow i forgot about these i placed these here cool i forgot all about that right let's go down a few levels i want to try and get some good loot maybe rubies and stuff like that so i'm gonna go down to maybe oh what's this is this water that's not good why is the water something bad happen here is it lava oh yeah there's lava um is that causing oh, don't tell me that's the whole way down is it no right that oh wow more lava more lava right okay yeah my uh mat hammer my real name's Matthew, so with the mat hammer. I think it's pretty cool. Let me see. I put the torches on the very right hand side. If I right click, bam, torch. Um the only thing is because it was quite the uh, I didn't have much materials, I could only make it out of iron, so I can only mine the stuff that you would normally get with iron. So there we go. Have still required tier two and mine I believe is only a tier one, but I'm not hundred percent sure how you can tell what it is. But at least Digging three, you can get stuff very quickly, and then you can just go with your pickaxe. Don't even ask me how to pronounce that name. I'm not going to do it. Simply not going to do it for you. 
useful DNS it's called, so it must be the person who made this mod pack has made his own mod as well. And uh, it's pretty cool. It's like diamond. It's as durable, if not more durable, I think 1,200, 500. That made no sense at all. 1,250 I meant to say. Uh, durability on it. Which is not bad, I don't think. Aussie more, I need some of this stuff as well. I'm planning, so normally the riddle line that I go down is thermal expansion. Decided to give it a miss this time. I know. Oh, God. wow. Let me find all them in one place together. Loads them. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, I, would, I normally go down the thermal expansion, but I might go down the mechanism. I think that's me mechanism. Mechanism. Someone's probably going to shit at me for saying it wrong, but mechanism. I'm going to call it mechanism. I like it. Uh, I might go down that, that route. Route then. Um, I think it would be quite cool. Let's see here. Just realised I've been streaming this whole time, and I don't know if I'm even talking. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm talking. I heard myself on the website. I'm good. Right. Ooh. A beehive? I have... Mm, I'll leave it. No. Right, do you think it's safe to go down this way yet again? Oh yeah, looks safe. Run! Right, number, it says number 10. I normally like going around level 14 or 15, so I'll go at level 14 here. Damn it. I'll just try and go in a straight line for a while anyway. Oh. Look at all the good stuff we're finding here already, huh? <gasps> no! Diamonds. Yeah, I think diamonds came a bit useless if we were giving them away for free. So, uh, yeah, I think it might be interesting to see what we do with this uh, get your money three points. Oh, is that a bit of lag? Hope not. 19.1 should be fine. Oh, what's this? Biomes of Plenty. Yeah, we fixed Biomes of Plenty. It's now working on this mod pack, so... Yeah, if you like Bounce of Plenty, go for the try. Diamonds, is there any more? Two's quite... Oh, yeah, there's more there. Four. Four's not bad anymore. Am I pushing my luck? I think I'm pushing it a bit, aren't I? I can hear some, something in there. Look at that. Look. Oh. It was... Hello, Mr. Zombie. Die. I can hear something else now. Who's it... digging down here? This doesn't look like... You know what? I might just continue going on down here. So I'm still needing to find some sapphires or gems of some sort to make some tools out of. Oh, what did you come from? Scared the jeepers out of me. Alright. Half an hour streaming already. Yeah, doesn't feel like it should, doesn't? Land through. Normally, oh, there's more diamonds. Normally we've got staff crawling around us left, right and centre here, but no one's here. Let me just check to see if people are hiding, because they don't want to speak. Um, Blitz and black is the Ghost cure is the Multi. Madeline is in tech support. What's she doing up there? I wonder if she's AFK. She normally goes AFK. This work. Yeah.
this hammer is pretty good. The thing I like as well, it's got auto repair on it, so I don't really need to worry about it breaking, but I do need to upgrade it soon. That's uh, pretty rubbish. I'm going to try and go to the nether and get cobalt and the other one that you get with it as well to make it strong. I can... There's stuff all around me. I swear I can hear stuff jumping. And take that one, and take that one. There's literally... Oh, if I run out of inventory. What I'm going to do maybe is dig a wee hole in here. I'm going to throw all the useless crap I don't want in here. Loads of cobble, rotten flesh. Do I want these or not? What can you use them for? What, a whole nine of them make one ingot? Uh, useful for some things, isn't it? Mm, you know what? I need infantry space. Screw it. Throw it away. Uh, more cobble. More cobble. Right. Don't make me pick it up. Uh, is it, no, it's not worthwhile. It's not. Oh well. It'll be fine. I'm sure we'll find more of it. The one problem with this uh, this hammer, though, is that you do pick up an, an enormous amount of stuff that you don't want. Uh, no, do you know what? Screw it. It's not even worth it. Not worth it at all. Oh. Let's just keep going this way. Da, da, da. Oh no. When you run under cobble, it's not a good show. Might go down this way a couple. And then this way. Does that. No. Maybe down a few more. Yeah. That's a lot better. Oh. Oh. I've got blocks in front of me that want, don't want to be there. Look at that. That's not... Uh-oh. 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 Disconnect. Oh yeah, look at this. I got the wee icon up and going. That looks pretty cool. Let's try and log in again. Right, God mode to the ready. I don't want to die. God mode. Right, so something. Look at that. How did that work out? Wow. Turn God mode off. You didn't see me cheating. You seen absolutely nothing. Some of the staff have uh, thought it's... Oh, yeah, this is one of the things. Fool's gold. Look at that. Down the bottom right-hand side. How annoying is that? You go, oh, gold. No, it's not. You get one nugget out of it. And sometimes a golden ingot. But very rarely anything more than a golden nugget. Nugget? Nugget. What's a nugget? Hmm. Decided to go up here for a wee, a wee trip. Yeah. I have not found one gem or one um, sapphire or anything yet. That's what I came down here looking for. Uh you bit dirt. No, there's that thing. Oh right, you know what? It's not even worth it. Right, I think I will throw that, 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 that. 
that, 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 that. There. I'm going to set home and um, temp. So that's my temporary home. And go back to spawn. So first thing I want to do is throw off some stuff. I'm a team player. I really am a team player. I'm going to put in some uh, of my... Oh, I thought I missed. I lost in the essence bush. I'm going to... Place them there. And go. Some lovely essence. Let's see. 26. What if I go up to... 31 and a half. Not bad. Um, we've got a dimension anchor here. I put it down running the server. Just That's the admin time. We thought we may as well have things running 24-7 to see if anything breaks. Why no one's here. So far it's been good. How long have we been up and running for? An hour? Look at that. We're flying. It did crash earlier on, but that was my own fault. Shut down the wrong server. Oopsies. Um... My stable dad has been apples. It really has. There's so many apples. You want an apple? Get away. Good sheep. He didn't want any apples. He, he mustn't have liked apples. Dark again, is it? No. Maybe it's just me. My sight going. But I think this area right here is quite cool. Seems very low to do. Let's put some stuff away, shall we? Oh, actually no. What will I do? Should I go over and um let me see. Right, so that, 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 that. That and that can go away, that can go away. Okay, so here's on the ores. I'm gonna bring these ones with me as well. May as well do all these at one go. Any other interesting ores? What about them? I'll show you some of the machines over here that have uh, started to learn and understand a wee bit. Wow. Wow. Why didn't I see them last time? But, wow. Ugh. I miss my applied energetic system. I really, really, really miss it. Things like this wouldn't happen. <sighs> right. Bring some more stuff with me. I have a lot of ore, don't I? I don't have my own machines yet to double the ore I'd put yet, so uh, I'm having to go over and use the, uh, the shared one at the minute, which is no problem with. No one else is on. That is all to myself. I might make a furnace for the ones over here whenever I get enough stuff to make one up. So, oh, my night. Hey, my Um, my night's been about for a while, so we'll let him in to test out the service here. Things are going. Like I said earlier on, you want to come on and play with us? Feel free. Drop me a mail, put a, uh, a post in the forums, grab me somewhere you can, and let me know that you want to join on. Um, Hello. Okay. So, yes, we've got the mechanism stuff and Ender IO stuff as well. I thought this was mechanism, but it's not. It's Ender IO. It's pretty cool. So, enrichment chamber. I believe we can throw stuff like this into, which you'll see. You'll hear a lot of noise. You. And that gives me dust. So, um, instead of sitting here all day and watching this, I may as well do something else, shouldn't I? Yeah, that probably wouldn't be too interesting for you, unfortunately. I wonder, right, something I've always wanted to know, and let me know in chat if you know this. So, this hammer, it's got auto repair on it, the slime ball one. Can I put it on a tool station, or does it have to be on my person? For the uh, for the dur uh, durability to go back up again. What's that? Actually, 
Right, that's 62. So, we'll come back and check in a bit and see what it's like then. Da -da -da. We really need some speed upgrades in this. Let's see, speed. Uh, weapon mechanism first. Speed upgrade. So we need enriched alloy and glass. And while we do that, we may as well use the energy one as well, which is gold enriched alloy. Enriched alloy is iron and redstone in this bad boy. Let's go and get that started. May as well make a whole bunch of it. So I think it's one for one, so I'll do a stack of gold, sorry, of iron and a stack of redstone. And that should be enough for me to use for a while. If I can find my stuff. These chests are annoying me already. Okay, so one redstone. Have I got enough for it? Uh, just enough, but do I really want to waste all that? Oh, well, I'm getting more back anyway, aren't I? Yeah, I'll be fine. It's a good investment. Good investment. Let's run over this way. What was that number again? 66, was it? I need to write it down. I have no pen. Oh well. 66, I think it was. So that's 640 and that's 64. Hopefully this will go down to 630. Perfect. Look at that. Exactly what I wanted to see. So that's done. I'm going to put in a lot of iron now. Because I need iron. Right, so copper dust. Can I put that in here? So, hang on. How much did I, copper dust did I put in there? So there's two in there now. Because ah, so it's just melting three at a time. That's a pretty cool, actually. Right, what do I like for power wise? I know there is a something at the back of this. Around this side. In here. Look, we've got plenty of power, and I believe it's getting its power from upstairs. A solar panel. Yeah, it's okay. It's night time. You would expect it at night time for the power to drain down, wouldn't you? So. Working. Right. What I think I need is some blazes as well. So let me see homes. Home skystone blaze. So I'm gonna change myself into look at oh look at this thing I found. I have to show you this. This is pretty cool. I don't know what happened or what this is, but yeah, it's me, but massive. Whoa. Yeah, um, I'm a little bit big now. I can't fit in. Doom, doom, doom. Look how weird your arms look. <laughs> oh. Which bracket? F6 before you can... Oh well, I forgot all about that. That's all. Switch back down. I like this thing as well. This thing's pretty cool. Me. But he's like halfway underneath. I don't know what's really going on here. Come on. Let's go. Fight me, bro. There's a lot of skeletons around here. I'm pulling out. I'm pulling out. Let's see. What else have I got? It's pretty cool looking. There's a wasp. Can you fly with the wasp? I don't really need to anywhere. I can fly. Oh, that's one of the Go to the blaze. Um, you might see a smoke screen here in a second. Sorry, guys. That's what the blaze does. He smokes everywhere. It goes over your eyes. Oh, well. Home. Blaze. Where did I get the bo oh yeah. 
So I've turned into a blaze. In case you guys don't know, a blaze is doesn't take fire damage. So the first projectile hit me, but I will not catch on fire. So I can fight these guys happily. Blah blah blah. blah. We're getting. Didn't even get one. Well, after all that, one bit ridiculous, I can Oh, almost fell. Need a little bit of health, don't they? Looks like something's out here. Oh, look, there it is. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Oh, wow. Wow. Um, where did I die? Hmm. Oh. Right. So, what? Get off that, you. You dare stop that. I ain't gonna turn on magnet mode, which I don't think is cheating. Personally. No. I think it's fine. I'm gonna turn on the wasp mode so I can see what I'm actually doing. I'm gonna break this. And hopefully I've got all my stuff back. Yeah. Put this back on. Not, 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 not. So yeah, um, don't go to the nether without some kind of armor. As you can see, it doesn't last. What is that? Is that a... Was that a wisp on fire? Her thing died. Is this... What biome is this? I'm not even going to say that. Oh. Hmm. Nvidia OpenGL driver detect a problem with the display driver and has had to close. So this is what we do. As staff, we take a look at the crashes and figure out what's going on. I'm going to hit no for the time being. So there we go. It's hit me out. I'm going to launch the mod pack up again. So, may as well show my screen. Loading the mod pack back up again. The mod pack does take a considerable amount of time to load up. Solely because it is so big. Why is there? Is that one loading? That one. Hmm. Close that one. Close. There. Okay. So, yeah, it'll take a considerable amount of time to load up because it is such a huge mod pack. Um, I want to say close to 200 mods in it. Like that, by 200 mods. These games I've had up here for ages now. Seriously, and Poseidon, I used to love it. My first computer game was Seuss Master of Olympus. And this is Susan Poseidon. Such an old game, I think, maybe from 2000. That's Cracker. Payday 2. Um, all the FTB and Minecraft Technic launchers. Access to the console. Um, a few games like Rust and Team Fortress, Sims. This is the icon. It was made by Derp. I think it's pretty cool looking. I like it. That's still loading. Let's see, is there anything going on on the website? No one's here. No one's here at all. Oh, 
Here we go. We've got something. So as you can see, it creates its own load screen as well. I think that's pretty cool. Anytime today. Doop, doop, doop. Let me see. Did I turn off my screen? Can you see this? Not yet. But yes. While I'm here, I may as well check the other servers just to make sure things are going okay. Looks like it. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to turn off screen one. Launch the game up. Let me see. One wee second. Right. Ooh, you can't see it. There we go. So we are back. Okay. And while we're here, we may as well go over and respawn. Check and see how the crafting's doing. Down here. Ooh. All I down there, so we'll put that in here. Last one of this. This would be pretty cool. Yeah. They're quite noisy machines, though, so they are. Mechanism. I don't know what the sag mill is. Sounds pretty cool. Do you reckon you put wood or something in here? You don't seem to put that in anywhere. Oh. Copper? What's copper give me? And copper powder. So it's doing something else. Wait. What? Did that? Right. One better. So I've got 25. If I put one in, that's 24. Why did I think that was giving me two for some reason there? Precision sawmill. No, that does. That gives me more wood. I need to get the inscribers working. Oh, does use this workshop use only? A load of stuff in here. I'm going to throw half of mine in there. Just go nice like that. Pop into stairs, looks like someone's downstairs. Is this pop into stairs? No. Nothing else. Got a load of good stuff coming through. Right. Well, I think that's going to do, do me for the time being, guys. I've been streaming now for 55 minutes. Looks to an hour. That'll do for now. Probably be, be back on either later on today or tomorrow then to go through a bit more streaming. Um, quite sad I didn't get speaking to any staff yet, but... Yeah, there's no one about at all. It's pretty dead. Strange. But as I said, guys, I will speak to you in a bit here then and enjoy the rest of your night.